Alright. Hey guys, Zero Eleven here. And today, we got 20 random packs of hockey cards. So, got a bunch of variety this time around. I don't have any more than two of the same pack. More than half of them are hobby. You got some retail, some good retail, but yeah. 20 random packs. It's been a while. I don't do these too often anymore, but I enjoy doing them. So let's show the packs. Uh, first pack you already seen is a pack of 1213 Opeachy, which is retail by the way, as well as 1920 Upper Deck MVP retail pack. It's just a gravity feed pack. Two packs of 1920 Tim Hortons. How did this survive? Because this pack survived this. So we're gonna see what the condition of these cards are. And this is not the only artifacts pack I will be opening today. Uh, we got two 1617 AHL, hopefully get an auto. And yes, I know Alex Tuck is a Vegas Golden Knight. I said when he was a part of the Wild organization. We got two 0910 Series 2, two 0910 Series 2. We got one 1516 Series 2 retail and one 1516 Series 2 hobby. We got some full force. We got some 1112 Black Diamond. Man, Patty Kane's really faded on there. Two 1415 Upper Deck Series 1 packs. A 1516 Upper Deck Series 1 hobby pack. And yeah, 1415 are hobby. Should have pointed that out, but yeah, they're hobby. So there's 1516 hobby. We got some 1920 Artifacts hobby. 1920 Artifacts hobby. We got one 1718 SB Authentic. And for the end, we have two 1819 SB Authentic packs. All right, let's start off with OPG 1213. So I guess we're looking for an auto, but it's over one in 1,000 packs. So yeah, OPG 1213. All right, okay, here we go. All right, we got Sheldon Surrey, Jason Spezza, Johnny Boychuk. Oh, that's pretty cool. We got a retro Wendell Clark. Retro Wendell Clark. That's actually pretty cool. Got Ryan Johansson, Brandon Prust. Okay. All right, now on to MVP. 1920, just a gravity feed pack. Why is it not opening? I've had these sitting around for literally months. If we get a Makar, I guess. Still need to do the box set. Uh, the box sets are already out. Uh, we got Jacob Vrana, Chris Tierney, and we got a 99-2000 Daily Cup Edition retro card, Jake Gensel. There you go, Jake Gensel. Got Martin Jones. And Joe Pavelski. Tim's. It's been a couple months. But I got two packs of Tim's. Didn't weigh him or anything. Still have some packs sitting around, but let's see what we get here. All right, we got Steven Stamkos. Got a highly decorated Gary Price. And Drew Doughty. Drew Doughty. Okay, one more pack of Tim's. It's only three cards a pack. Get a clear cut. Or a 3D card. I forgot their color already. Jeez, uh, the duos. Mark Stone. The heck. We got two Carey Price highly decorated. And Connor Hellbuck. Alright, let's see what these cards look like. Because they went through a lot. They went through a lot. Alright. Let's see, we've got Ryan Getzlaff. Dustin Brown. Bobby Orr, they're not in bad shape for what happened to him. Got Doug Wilson, Ryan Callahan. Okay. All right, now on to 1617 AHL. Let's try to get an autograph. 1617 AHL. Okay. All right. Marco Dano, Curtis Lazar, so some familiar names there. Zach Fucali, another familiar name. Vladislav Kamenev, another familiar name on the Avs. And Mac Caruth. Mac Caruth. Huh. Alright, next pack of AHL. Honestly, I'll take any autograph at this point at all. Alright. Michael Layton. Here we go, Michael Layton. Mike Sislo. Another Kamenev. There we go, there's a- Oh, wow! Okay. Jacob Vrana auto. He's great. He's been fantastic for the Washington Capitals. Jacob Vrana. Autograph with the Hershey Bears. Those are cool uniforms. 
But yeah, there you go, Jacob Verena Auto. He had rookies in 16, 17. I'm not going to go fish out my Verena future watch, but yeah, really cool. Very cool. First hit of the 20 random packs. And the final card, Colin Greening. All right, 910 Series 2. So frickin' Brad Marchand, Brain Holpe, John Carlson. Those are the ones we're looking for. Dubnik as well. So yeah, 910 Series 2. All right, let's open this up. Okay, I got this from a championship collection box. Marco Sturm, Oscar Moeller, Alex Golgowski. You got Dan Hamus, back on the Preds now. <laughs> James Reimer, gold, victory gold rookie. Wow, I might as well start the Reimer PC then. Jeez, all right. So there you go, Reimer gold rookie, so I'll take it. You got Donald Brashear, number 87, Donald Brashear. You got Duncan Keith and Fernando Pisani. Man, this stuff is 10 years old, and most of these players aren't even in the league anymore, so. Wow. All right. You got Vernon Fiddler. Radis Evenins. Ratias Evenins. Um, he was known for getting knocked out by Steve McIntyre. Got Corey Perry. Fucking Brad Marchand, victory rookie. I don't know if that goes for anything, but there you go. There he is. The right victory rookie, Brad Marchand. That Luke Shen. No, it's not. It's Nicholas Hagman. Jeez, Nicholas Hagman. That's part of the Dion trade right there. Nicholas Hagman. Let's see who we got here. Frederick Mayer. Sammy Sallow. And Eric Cole. Alright, 1516 Series 2 Retail. Okay, let's get something here. We got Patty Kane. Troy Brower. Ryan Johansson. TJ Oshi. And a portraits rookies of Jared McCann, who's on the pens now. Speaking of the pens, we got Phil the Thrill. Phil Kessel now on the Arizona Coyotes, and they're doing very well. It's probably because of Phil. <laughs> Merrick Zidlitsky and Brett Connolly. All right, now on to the hobby pack of 1516 Series 2. Seems like a normal pack. So yeah, let's open it up. Uh, the last pack I opened of 1516 Series 2 only had five cards. I did get a Young Guns, though. Okay. All right, we got Dale Weiss, Jimmy Hayes, Yarmer Yager, David Jones, and just a Brock McGinn, marquee rookie. Brock McGinn. Got Martin Jones, Tyler Toffoli, and Sam Gagne. All right, full force. Autos were like every other box, and 3D full force freshman was every box. It was like one in four blasters way back when, but this is a hobby pack. So yeah, I think there was 18 packs. It was 18 or 20 in a hobby box. A couple years ago, I opened one. I actually opened one off camera. I opened quite a few blasters as well. Okay, we got Rick Nash. These are cool cards. Rick Nash, Nathan McKinnon. We got a goal. Dang, I was looking for the koozie goal. But there you go, Jacob De La Rose goal. On the blues now. It's doing all right, Jacob De La Rose. We got Steve Mason and John Carlson. Look, I got a pack of Black Diamond. It didn't cost me 300 bucks. Wow. It's like five bucks. But yeah, let's check it out. Black Diamond. Looks like we got a filler card. All right. So we got Dustin Brown, single diamond. Uh, we got Tyler Sagan. Hard to see the names. We got Cam Ward, double diamond. So yay, there's a... So that's what we get in the pack. A double diamond, a Cam Ward. We got Craig Anderson. He's still got a Colorado glove and blocker on. And we got, was that, Travis Hamanick Young? Travis Hamanick. Second year? Yeah, second year. All right, 14, 15, Series 1. Leon Dreisaitl. I will be opening a hobby box of this stuff soon, but we're looking for Dreisaitl. Johnny Goodrow, Tavo, Tara Vinen, Kuzi. There's quite a few good ones in here, so yeah. That being said, there are some real bad ones in here as well, but let's pull something interesting. From 14, 15, Series 1. Semyon Varlamov. We got Young Guns. We got Paul Martin, Mike Smith, and... Uh, this guy predicted... Curtis... L that was one of the last ones I needed in 1415 for the set. I needed uh, Lazar and Percy, I think, were my last two for the set. But there you go, Curtis Lazar Young Guns. On Buffalo now. Basically like AHL guy, and you'll get called up every now and then. But yeah, Curtis Lazar. I like the 1415 Young Guns, they're real cool. But there you go, Curtis Lazar. Jaden Schwartz. Rick Nash. Ryan Johansson. And Jeff Zatkoff. Jeff Zatkoff. 
Okay, another pack of 1415 Upper Deck Series 1. Okay, so we get here. It's sticking a little. Got Joe Pavelski. Yeah, there we go. Slava Voinov. Yeah, there we go. Got Vinny LeCavalier. Got Upper Deck Canvas. Henrik Sedin. That's cool. Upper Deck Canvas. Henrik Sedin. There we go. Got Logan Couture. Dwight King. Can't tell if that was during the finals or not. It should be like Alec Martinez in the LA. If it was against the Rangers there. Got Andrew McDonald. And Chris Higgins. All right. 15-16 Upper Deck Series 1. We all know who's in here. I hope you know who's in here. It's a hobby pack, so... Can I get a high gloss McDavid, please? That'd be nice. Okay. I don't even know if the, you can still pull them. Well, looks like we didn't get that. Dang. Mark Stahl. Brent... Oh. Brent Burns, Alish Hemsky, and the Shining Stars, Blue, Center, John Tavares. We got Darren Helm, Nick Felino, Corey Crawford, and Tuka Rask. All right. Artifacts 1920. I'm not doing a retail versus hobby. I refuse to actually buy any artifacts if I'm properly opening it. So if you want to compare like one pack to a blaster, this is 10 times better. You can get so much better things from the hobby pack. Just a single hobby pack. I think this costs like 17 bucks for a pack. That's way better than a blaster that costs like 20 bucks or 30 bucks. So yeah. Let's open up this artifacts hobby pack. Artifacts treated me well this year, that's why I'm opening more. Okay, let's see what we got in here. Looks like we got a big old filler card. Or not. <laughs> okay, artifact. Oh, jeez. We got a gold rookie. We got Andrew Ladd. It's probably going to be a patch card. That's... Oh, no. It's just a regular jersey, I think. Hopefully it's signed. I don't know if the golds are signed. We got Matthew Kachuk. Uh, Frickin' Abramoff. Be signed, at least. All right, well, we got a Vitaly Abramoff. Artifacts rookie jersey 415 of 499. Vitaly Abramoff. There you go. Two red swatches. There you go. Been worn by the featured player. It's probably gonna be a lot of Abramoff in a lot of sets. He was at the upper deck shoot. Probably signed a lot. So there you go. Abramoff. Eh. All right, now on to gambling. We got some 1718 SP Authentic. Actually, this costed like eight or nine bucks for a pack. So. Again, I had the 1718 Future Watch set. I'm not really looking for any particular card. Just hoping for an autograph. That'd be cool. I believe they're like one in nine packs for an autograph. So let's hopefully get one here. That'd be cool. Okay, I don't got a Spectrum. Yay. Ryan Johansson. There's 1718. Haven't opened this in a while. Uh, we got a JFK Spectrum. Victor Hedman. We got Jacob Forrest Baca Carlson. Longest freaking name. Future Watch. Spectrum FX level one. At least there's a future watch. There we go. JFK. Spectrum Future Watch. Got Marc Andre Fleury and Logan Couture. All right, now on to 1819, where I'm missing like a lot. I'm missing a lot of future watches. I'd love to get one here. Love to get anything really, not just a plain old insert. But yeah. Uh, Max Domi, Philip Forsberg. Got a Brendan Perlini. Brandon Perlini, update card. Got Patty Kane and Charlie McAvoy. Loose SBA is a. It's probably not worth it. This is going to make me want to go tear into my boxes, which. <laughs> I don't know if I should do that yet. Okay. You got Brent Burns, Nathan McKinnon. You got frickin' Rasmus Dahlin, authentic moments. Rasmus Dahlin. Leon Dreisidel. And Colton Pareko. So yeah, guys. There's 20 random packs. Those are probably the two best cards. These are alright as well. Could have been worse. So yeah, guys. Stay tuned for more breaks to come. As always, thanks for watching. And I'll see you guys later.